Hello, Pisces. This is your reading for June 2019. This is for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. I know, I know, I know, guys. I am late with this, <clears throat> but I am here now. Let's see. Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Jupiter. Love messages for Pisces. We have the Ten of Swords here, feeling betrayed, wanting to give up on something is what I'm getting from you guys here. Um, could be a Gemini that you guys are thinking about or that has done this to you or you're feeling betrayed by this person here. But it's like all I really wanted to know was the truth about a situation. And um, what I'm getting is that there's something that you guys didn't expect to come out or something that you learned that it's like you, you, you thought something in particular about this person or this situation, but then it's not that information that, that comes to you. It's like something else that, that you really weren't even thinking of that kind of hits you like a ton of bricks and just kind of like, it was it. Okay. Let's see what's crossing you guys here. And we have the Eight of Cups. <laughs> needing to walk away, needing to not just say you're going to do it, but actually taking your emotional energy away from this situation and not allowing it to take you down further. Okay, I'm also getting that somebody is really thinking about the things that they have done. Um, this person may have walked away from you and is wanting to come back, wanting to try to make things right with you, start over, tell you some truth. Um, whatever they did, I'm getting for some of you, whatever they, they did that affected you on this really, really emotional level um, even if they left like and said that they weren't happy it made you feel like there was somebody else involved it made you feel like you weren't good enough in actuality I feel like you guys were this person's wish okay there is some emotional baggage that this person has to deal with or has had to deal with um, before they can come back to you in a way that you need for them to. So um, there is a situation here where somebody is really going through it right now and I know you guys feel betrayed but trust and believe they didn't escape whoever this is okay. Let's see what the underlying issue is here. The Eight of Wands. Um, somebody moved, I feel like, away. Um, and it was pretty fast. It, it kind of caught you off guard. I feel like you guys had issues, but like parting ways was not something that you truly expected. And I feel like this person did this rather abruptly here. This is Sagittarius energy. Hmm. So maybe you guys don't live in the same um, area right now. They may not live across the country, but it's, they, they moved, I feel, for a lot of you. Or either you guys have just kind of um, grown apart. Hmm. Let's see what's going on in the recent past. Five of Wands, a lot of conflict, a lot of arguing, um, a lot of miscommunication, a lot of fighting. Could have been physical fighting, does not have to be, but definitely um, not getting along, not being on the same page here. Leo energy there. Somebody was very much, I, I'm feeling like they, their ego was being, you know, what do you call it? They were having their ego stroked by just how deeply you felt for them. 
and I feel like this person was probably acting an ass with you okay you know that saying hurt people hurt and I feel like that's kind of what was going on in this situation let's see what you guys your crowning thoughts are here the five of cups I'm feeling that you guys kind of wish you never met this person that's just how much anguish um, you have felt with this situation you have a lot of regrets um, right now you're heartbroken you're 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 feeling it you're feeling it okay and I'm feeling like a lot of you just want to feel nothing I feel a tower moment here things that you thought were are no longer and um, it, it's like trying you in every way there's still a part of you that loves this person but I'm feeling like you know it's like I don't want to it hurts too bad what's coming in for my Pisces three of swords energy this is being heartbroken I'm feeling like you guys are gonna have an opportunity to um, discuss something with this individual because I do feel this person is coming back I feel them coming back I don't I don't really see them coming back in the month of June though but I'm, I'm I'm sensing that there is more disappointment to come because, you know, I'm feeling like you guys are expecting this person to reach out. You're wanting them to because I'm feeling like you, you're wanting, you know, some closure here. It's what you're wanting. Let's see how you're viewing this situation. This is Aquarius energy. Five of Pentacles, feeling very hurt, rejected. Caught off guard because regardless you guys felt like you and this individual you guys are going to be together through whatever through thick and thin that you could work it out as long as you were together but now it's like you know you have to pick up the pieces yourself we have three fives here this is definitely a tower moment for some of you and I'm sorry I'm so very sorry because I know it's hurtful. It's very hurtful. But there's there's definitely something that that you know needed to come down, needed to be broken up because there's something there was something so not right with the situation that you were involved in with this individual. And so in order for you to get back on the proper footing, you know, you kind of have to like wipe shit out and you know start up on the right footing that way when you get up to the top it's going to be stable because at the bottom is stable so but I know this is hurtful when you're going through it okay let's see what the influence is for you guys the six of wands you want to be on top again I'm feeling too that again you know, you guys were stroking someone's ego and didn't even know it. All you were doing was giving them the love and affection that you that you feel like you would want. You were just giving them what you want as well. But that is almost like you guys made a monster in a sense, okay? Because you make them feel so much bigger and so much better than what they actually are or were. Um, so now they feel like because Pisces felt this way about me, everybody's going to feel this way about me. And so that is the attitude I feel like this person walked away with. But um, they're eating that right now. Trust and believe. They're feeling the loss of you. Okay, they're not sitting up on their high horse. They're really not. They're wanting it. They're definitely wanting it. And they're wanting you to feel that way, but that's not the case, I don't feel. Okay. 
let's see what the hopes or fears are for you guys here the eight of swords oh my gosh your fear is that you will never be able to get over this mentally that you will be stuck in all this past bullshit and all of this sorrow and regret and feeling rejected and this person, you know, they fought me or they they constantly were picking arguments with me. They constantly were on social media trying to be noticed, liking pictures, going out on dates, going to the clubs, what have you. Your fear is that you will constantly be bombarded with all of these memories and what this person did. No. No, 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 no. No, it will get better. It will get better. I promise it will. Let's see what the outcome is for you guys. This is hard. This is hard, my Pisces friends. Let's see. The outcome here is judgment. Okay, you have to decide what's best for you. I can't tell you what's best for you. But with all of these cards here, I feel like in order for you to really, to really be able to like think clearly, you're going to have to really move yourself away from this situation and look at it for what it is what has happened how do you feel when judgment comes whatever decision that you make it's going to be long lasting okay but I feel like I feel like you guys are on the road to making the right decision because I'm looking at the influence here with the Six of Wands and this is the outcome that you guys will definitely gain the perspective that you need. Um, you will gain the confidence that you need and you will make a right and just decision here for yourself this is also i feel like a rebirth when this tower moment is happening for you some for some of you you're going through it already you're going to come out as the phoenix as a new person and the stuff that you put up with up in here you will no longer be that person that will put up with that shit. okay trust and believe it's hard right now my friends but it will get better okay so we have Scorpio here um, Gemini Aquarius Leo Taurus Sagittarius is here and um, that is what I have for you guys and I'll be speaking with you guys soon bye now